Hello Internet, I'm Hazel, and this is a closer look at the barbershop options for the new male human model in the Warlords of Draenor beta. Alright, so we'll get started by taking a look at the hairstyles. This is the Samson look. A little long, a little messy. Reminds me a lot of the loose hair on the female human. This is the Prince look. Short hair, a little bit of volume. Makes him look like kind of a jerk, but that's just me. <laughs> this is the spikes look. Big voluminous spikes heading straight back. This is the swept look. Similar to spikes, but not quite as many spikes. He simply had a hair dryer and blew it all back. This is the foxtail, very popular hairstyle. Blood Elven, nice long hair down the front. A big ponytail in the back. Perfect for any wannabe Varian Rids. This is the slicked look. Fairly straightforward shoulder length hair. We have Bald. He is bald. He has a little bit of a shadow. Um, on the back of his head, and then the top of it is all shiny and bright. This is the peasant look. Nice respectable short hair. This is the soldier look. Something reminiscent of Lieutenant Sarge from uh, Pokemon, if you ask me. All flat across the top. This is the monk look. Nice and simple, balding on top. Look of wisdom, perhaps. We have the barbarian hair. Rather dwarvish. Nice big rings along each lock of hair there. Very nice. This is the dashing look. We have loose hair. This is the courtier look. Courtier? Courtier? I don't know. Back from his face a little bit if you want to see his beautiful features. This is the scholar look, similar to the monk, but a little bit longer. And the rogue look. Nice and popular. A less flamboyant ponytail than the foxtail. Still good length. Hair nice and neat. Good for any rogue, or any class for that matter. And we are back to fabulous. Can't argue with that. So, let's take a look at the hair colors available to us. Nice simple brown. Blonde. Light brown, light darker light brown, gray, and lighter gray, and black, and we're back to our rich deep red, so nice simple options. Let's take a look at facial hair. You can be bearded. Uh, it is to be noted that I don't think the facial hairs are quite finished yet. The color is in place, but there aren't really any textures. It kind of looks like he, draw, he drew a beard with a sharpie on his face. So these are most likely unfinished and hopefully will be updated before the release of Draenor. Some of them have texture, like this one here. The Colonel, big fluffy mustache. Seems to, it's hard to tell with the hair, but it seems to have a bit of a trajectory sticking it from under his nose there. And then you also get a little bit of a goatee that again needs some texture. This is the dualist look. Same mustache, now curls down with the same goatee. The goatee, which is uh, a remarkable goatee. I don't even know if you can call it a goatee anymore. More of a donkey tee, if you ask me. Um, big, fluffy hair. <laughs> the wizard look, same, same sort of beard, but now it is connected all through there um, and connects to his mustache as well. That man does not believe in shaving. These are chops. This is quite the statement. We'll leave it at that. 
the Van Dyke look. <laughs> Which is basically a goatee combined with that mustache. Mustachioed. Mustache with no chin hair. And we are back to clean shaven. So there you have it. Those are the barbershop options for the new male human model. I think they look pretty good. Hopefully they get that, as a, that facial hair sorted out and get some of those looking a little bit fluffier. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you think. Check out the channel for other content from the Warlords of Draenor Beta if you're into that kind of thing. And have a wonderful, wonderful day. Bye!